Dynasine, take three. Seven years in Folsom. In the hole for three. McNeil before that. McNeil is tough, as they say. You looking to become a penologist? You looking to go back? I've chased down some crews, guys just looking to fuck up, get busted back. Is that you? You must have worked some pretty dipshit crews. I've worked all kinds. You see me doing thrill seeker liquor store holdups with a born to lose tattoo on my chest? No, I do not. That's right. I am never going back. And don't take down scores. I do what I do best. I take down scores. You do what you do best. You try to stop guys like me. So you never wanted a regular type life? The fuck is that? Barbecues and ball games? Yeah. This regular type life, this your life? My life. Now my life's a disaster zone. I got a stepdaughter. So fucked up because her real father is this large type asshole. I got a wife, passing her on the downslopes of our marriage, my third, because I spend all my time chasing guys like you around the block. That's my life. A guy told me one time. Never let yourself get attached to anything you're not willing to walk out on in 30 seconds flat if you're feeling the heat coming around the corner. Now, if you're on me and you gotta move when I move, how do you expect to, to keep a marriage? That's an interesting point. What are you, a monk? I have a woman. What do you tell her? I tell her I'm a salesman. So if you spot me coming around that corner, you're just gonna walk out on this woman? Not say goodbye? That's the discipline. Sounds pretty vacant, no? It is what it is. It's either that or you and I better both find something else to do, pal. I don't know how to do anything else. Neither do I. I don't much want to either. Neither do I. You know, I've got this recurring dream where I'm sitting at this big banquet table and all the victims of all the murder cases I ever worked are sitting there staring at me with these black eyeballs because they got eight ball hemorrhages from the head wounds. They're sitting there, these big balloon beams because I found them two weeks after they'd been under the bed. The neighbors reported the smell. There they are, all of them, just sitting there. What did they say? Nothing. No talk? No. They don't have anything to say. They just sit there and look at each other. They look at me. And that's it. That's the dream. I have one where I'm drowning and I have to wake myself up so I can breathe, so I don't die in my sleep. You know what that's about? Yeah, having enough time. Enough time? To do what you want to do? Yep. You doing it now? No, not yet. I'm 
You know, we're sitting here like a couple of regular fellas. I mean, you do what you do, I do what I gotta do. Now that we've been face to face, if I'm there and I gotta put you away, I won't like it. But I'll tell you, if it's between you and some poor bastard whose wife you're gonna turn into a widow, brother, you are going down. There's a flip side to that coin. Let's say you do have me boxed in and I gotta put you down because no matter what, you will not get in my way. Yeah, we've been face to face, but I will not hesitate, not for one second. Maybe that's how it'll be. Or who knows? Well, maybe we'll never see each other again.